Hey guys, this is Simi with Aquaforce Pressure Wash out of Oklahoma. I just want to show you guys a quick way to winterize your uh, trailer. Um, we're still in the winter time and we want to protect the equipment, um, hoses included, from freezing up. What I did was I went to my uh, uh, hose place where I get my hoses fixed and I had to make me a hose fitting. Okay, so all it is. This right here, this pink hose, is going right into my pressure line right here. And this end here is going to hook up to a uh, the other end of my compressor. You guys know I have a compressor on my uh, on my trailer. I did the same thing here for my supply hose line. Hook it up just like you would a regular guardian. It's my pressure end. So once I do this, uh, you guys can never see it. I'm going to hook it up. You guys see that? I'm flushing out all the water. Water's flushing out. You guys see that? Real quick. So what you're going to do, let that run. Matter of fact, that water that you can see, it's pretty much all, it's pretty much out. That's just, that right there is just a little bit of residue. That's not going to freeze up. Okay? So, that's all you have to do to get all of the water out of the, out of the line and you're done. And if you don't have a compressor, have the guys make you one that will uh, hook up to a compressor at a gas station. It's going to work the same way and just go there like you would, like, like you're going to fill up your tire. But instead of the compressor line uh, nail bin on the end, you're going to have to uh, put one that's going to work for airing up your tire. It's the same concept. So, boom, that's done. All that line, that line is completely done. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to disconnect. This right here, my supply hose line. All right? Same thing. Run it. Connect it. Let's see if you guys... Sorry, guys. I'm trying to hold it in a... Uh, uh, well, you guys saw it. Boom. Now I got my supply line. All right. You guys know those hoses are not cheap at all. So right now, flushing all the water out. Oh, it's flushing all the water out. So now you're pretty much done with the exception of one thing. There is still, uh, there is still air in the pump. All right, guys. So all you have to do with that being said, just using this machine, you guys know I got that Lambda uh, 5000 PSI. I was using this machine. So what I'll do is I'll disconnect this here. This is coming out of it. All right. I'll disconnect just this line here. That's all you have to do. Disconnect the line where it's coming out of the machine. Turn your machine on. Let it run for only probably about 10 seconds. It's going to shoot the rest of the water that's already stored in the line here and in the pump. And it's going to uh, flush that water out. And guess what, guys? You're done. All right? And so am I. I'll talk to you later. Uh, you guys got uh, some good uh, questions. Continue to email, uh, email me. I'll respond back as soon as I can. But uh, good luck to you guys. All right. Have a good one.